Welcome guys to another video. I'm going to be giving my reaction to the Brass Arch Bridges event in SimCity Build It. And in short, this this is going to be one of my most biggest criticisms of events. Um, I'm just going to say it right now plainly. It's the worst event I've ever seen in the game, in, in the history that I played the game. I'm not, like, I'm serious. It's one of the worst events. I'm not just saying that, and I'm going to show you why. Okay, so Brass Arch Bridges, again, uh, this is the event rules. Okay, so free thousand simoleons, you'll get first free golden keys. Free, it was at five at one point. Seems like they cheapened out the free. Now, this is what gets me a little upset, is the reward. Brass Arch Bridge. It's pretty cool. It honestly, it looks cool. It actually looks like a, kind of like a real life bridge, honestly. If you know uh, the Roberto Clemente bridge in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, go look it up. You can just find images. Um, but it looks like something in real life, uh, and I think that's cool, you know. Uh, but anyways, um, it's only going to give you a 16% boost on a 14 by 14, wait. A 16% boost by a 14 by 14 area. Now, a 14 by 14 area, that's that's a pretty big area, honestly. That's, you know, it's not small. Usually, landscape specializations will be crap. Um, so, compared to other landscape specializations, this is actually pretty good. Um, but it's only going to give you a 16% boost. Now, that's not really a big event prize. Now, here's the problem with this event. Let's get through this. You got a big lake, right? Area expansion items. More. Another Brass Arch Bridge. Big lake. Another Brass Arch Bridge. Stim cash. Another Brass Arch Bridge. Here's my problem with this event. The four... Uh, look, there's five specializations you can get. You can get the Big Lake, which is uh, a crappy landscape specialization. They're all landscape specializations. And it's all the same. It's four. Four bridges. That's it. There's no grand prize. There's nothing with a significant population boost um, in the event track. There's nothing. There's just nothing there, essentially. When I say this is the worst event, it really is. Because there's not one prize to aspire to. For example, because of the boost, it's not really worth it. You don't even need a bunch of these bridges. And let's say you just want one bridge just because you like how it looks. Well, then you can just get, for example, the first, uh, the third tier of the event, this one. You can just get that bridge. And if you don't want more bridges, well, you don't have to really grind in the event because it's just the same rewards. Having four of the same rewards in an event seems ridiculous to me. Um, I just find it ridiculous because four of the same specialization, the same specialization, nothing original, nothing new. Essentially, the Brass Arch Bridge is new, but it's just a bridge, right? You know what it reminds me of? You, I don't know if you guys remember this, but they had an aqueduct update. I, I don't know when. Sometime this year. And they did this update, and they had an event with aqueducts. This was very similar to this, having just, you know, a landscape specialization that frankly does nothing and you know they haven't had an event like this where you know you just have um you know an event where all you get is bridges or a landscape specializations that doesn't have good statistics but they're doing this again and this is this is alarming because you know we expect a good event and when we get something like this like we get one new bridge I mean, if you want to look the actual update what has changed before the update and now is they added one bridge that's it. One bridge. One! I mean, I think we know that there needs to be more changes to the game than just a bridge. We need to see updates constantly. The game literally updates like once a week. Literally. Once a week. Sometimes twice, but mostly once a week. And then, if you update once a week, and then they get a small update like this. It's just, it's not, it's not worth competing for bridges, essentially. Comment if you agree with me, right? I mean, I don't feel like it's worth it to comment. I mean, I sorry. Please comment. But I don't feel like it's worth it to get bridges. Do you agree? Please comment. Because the bridges, frankly, they're not worth it. That's just essential. That's just what it is. They're just not worth it. And let me show you guys real quick. The bridges, if you don't want to compete in this event at all, if you do not compete in this event, if you do not grind, go ahead. Do some club wars. Um, do whatever you got to do. Don't worry about grinding this event. You know why? You know why? Because those aren't even limited time. You can still get those bridges without completing this event, essentially. So, let me go to landscape specializations. And as you could see here, here's the Brass Arch Bridge. 14 by 14 area. A 16% boost. Um, 
you can buy it for free sin cash. So you can do nothing. It's going to stay probably. But you can do absolutely nothing in this event. And you can get a bunch of those. Like a bunch. It's ridiculous how much you can get because they're so cheap to buy. Which, you know, they should be cheap. I just, you know, I find it ridiculous why this is an event. Like, you could have just made the change and, you know, added the bridge in the landscape category. But instead, they had to make this whole event, which I find really dumb. Again, one of the worst events I've ever seen. And I'm not kidding when I say that. It really is one of the worst events. We're going to have uh, six days left from uh, Wednesday. So it's going to end Tuesday night, as do all events. Um, and, you know, next Wednesday, we're going to see what it, what what updates are they going to give us, right? I don't know. But it's got to improve. The only way you can go from here is up, because this is the worst possible update I've seen. You can only go up from here, SimCity Build It. So come on, bring us some good updates. Um, and plus, you know what I find about this event is not only the bridges, not only the specialization creativity, but one thing I also like about events is that you can easily collect stuff that, that you need. Something like speed up tokens, which you see in every event, usually as of recent, um, city storage items. There's none of that. Platinum keys. Usually there's something like that. There's none of that. The only thing you get is sim cash way at the end. You get some area expansion items and the golden keys and the simoleons. So not only do you only get the brass arch bridges, but, you know, you get the golden key and uh, the area expansion items. And then, plus, they have the audacity They have two big lakes. Let me tell you, these, all of these specializations, the big lake and the brass arch bridges, statistically, these are, they're the worst landscape. Remember when I said gambling was the best category specialization in the game? Well, let me also tell you that landscape is the worst the worst category in the game. It's cheap prices, but it really doesn't have an effect. And I'm going to tell you something. I used to have a, a lake, a pond, or a pond, whatever you want to call it, in my city. I actually did, but I deleted it. You know why? Because having bridges and having lakes, because you need the bridges to go over water usually for the aesthetic design. But anyways, it's too costly on your population. I understand some people like the aesthetic aspect of it, but I tried. And you're taking up a lot of space when you make ponds. Well, I made a big lake, essentially. And that took up a lot of space. And I wasn't, you know, gaining enough population, essentially, because of it. So, big lakes and the br lakes, ponds, bridges, etc. Anything in the landscape category, if you're looking to boost your population, do not go for those. Do not. And the fact that they make an event that's advocating you to get these for free... It's not even like a reward. These honestly should be close to free in general. I mean, they're mostly bad. And the fact that we have to waste sim cash for them, it's just ridiculous. So I'm going to give this event in conclusion. I'm going to give this event a one star. A one star. It's, you know what? If a zero star is possible, let me give it a zero star. There is not one thing. No, not one thing in this event that I'm looking forward to getting. You know, I know that the city expansion items, the area expansion items may be helpful, but I'm not going to waste the time to go through that. I'd rather do Club Wars. By the way, those of you that are in my club, I'm going to try to do some uh, Club Wars, uh, hopefully in this week, because I probably wouldn't have time to gain war supplies if I was, you know, trying to uh, collect materials to compete in this event. But I was, so I was going to take a break from war, but essentially I should be, you know, trying to do war because I'm not going to be trying in this event. Honestly, I'm not going to try. What I will do is that I'm going to try to get the simoleons, the golden keys, and the brass arch bridge. Once you get the first brass arch bridge, um, you might as well stop. I mean, I might go as far as the area expansion items, but I'm not going to, you know, grind for it. If I can get there, that would be awesome because I really need those items right now. Um, but after that, there's really no point just to get more bridges and lakes. And there's no point to get all the sim cash because 40 sim cash because... Frankly, it just takes too long for just that reward, and it's just a bunch of bridges, and it's honestly not that good. Um, so that will be it for today. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate all your support. Um, you know, please comment. I like to hear what you got to say, and I like to, you know, uh, so please comment. Um, please check out my Twitter. I really appreciate that if you do. Um, you can probably find a link in the description. So please check that out. Um, 
all are welcome to join my club. I know some of you already have, and I that's awesome. Um, but you know, memberships there. I'm at like 13 members, I think. So we got we're already past the halfway mark. We got 12 memberships left. Um, so get those slots, you know, before they get taken up. Once we do get full, I'll address the problem there, but another time. Um, also, please tune in for Saturday. I got an epic video coming up where I'm going to read some of the vice president of EA's quotes about SimCity Build. Yes, the vice president of EA, who EA is the company that created SimCity Build it. Yes, I'm going to read some of, of what his opinion on the game is. And I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I, I not, not to leave you in suspense, but please tune in Saturday because that's going to be fun. That's going to be fun. Um, thanks so much for watching.